Hey there, Will Gibbons here. If you've ever tried to render a glass bottle in Keyshot and needed to put some sort of a label or a sticker or a logo on it, you probably ran into a familiar situation as I have here. If we look a little bit closer, we see our label and then behind it, we see some sort of either reflection or shadow, however that appears to you. It is nonetheless distracting and not something that's been easy to get rid of in the past. Now I'm using Keyshot 2023.1. It's the latest version of Keyshot. And there's a new feature in here that makes this easy to get rid of with one click. Check that out. So as soon as I toggle that off, I am no longer seeing those unwanted artifacts from my labels inside the glass bottle. Now I'm gonna show you how to do that real quickly. So here we have the same issue where we have our labels being reflected in the inner wall of the glass bottle. And by the way, if you wanna test this out, you can download this bottle from my file vault on my website, totally free. Now, if you're not familiar with the material graph, quick tour, we've got the root node for this to the right. We have a material on our surface, that's the dielectric, which is like a glass material. And then we have two plastic nodes. Those represent the material that our labels are made out of and they are label one and two. And then I have a graphic or a PNG plugged into the diffuse channel of each plastic material, and those are our labels. So how do we get rid of this unwanted reflection here? Now, if I right click in the material graph, go down to utilities and choose ray mask, I get a new node. This ray mask node used to be an experimental feature in older versions of Keyshot, but is now released in the stable version of Keyshot 2023. All we need to do with this is plug this into the opacity channel on both of my labels and it will affect both labels equally. Now, when I double click on ray mask, we get a host of options or properties that we can toggle on and off that will affect these labels. For example, if I turn off apply to front of geometry, it will hide those labels from the front of our bottle. If I turn off apply to back of geometry, then it hides the back as well and we can't see them at all. We also have a, an opacity slider. So if we slide this left to right, we can fade those in and out, which is pretty cool. We can also make them visible in shadows, reflections, visible to our camera, all sorts of things. But what we're looking for to fix our issue with our labels here is to simply disable apply to back of geometry. And just like that, we have clean labels on our glass bottle without the distracting reflections. And I think this is gonna be best for people who are working in packaging or graphic design and they really just want maybe not the most photorealistic, but the most aesthetic or pleasing representation of their design. So there you go. Super short video. Hopefully it was helpful. And until next time, happy rendering.